How you doing guys and welcome to another video and in this video I'm going to show you how to remove the 30 minute record limit from your Olympus EM1 Mark II. Now the most important things I've got to say are one make sure your battery is charged I want it fully charged so you don't run into any problems. Two this is version 3.4 and it comes from the original Olympus file Okay, so it's not a modified thing like Magic Lantern or whatever. It's only a few strings that are modified so it removes the recording limits. And then thirdly, you must remember that there's always a risk of doing this kind of thing. You could, you could brick your camera. Now I've tried this out. I've had the camera running now for quite a few days now, four, four days maybe, and I've had no problems at all. So you should be okay. Okay, so put your SD card inside your computer. And when you open it, you're gonna be met with these two folders. ALBM and DCIM. We want to go into the ALBM folder and you can see we've got this dot bin here. We can just delete this file. So let's move that to bin. Then the file that you downloaded from the link down below, just double click that to unzip it. If it gives you this archive utility uh, unsupported format, don't worry, just okay that. And then we're left with this dot bin file here. Then you can just copy this straight into the memory card. Okay, so that's now your update file and that's the version 3.4. Okay, and that's in your ALBM folder. Now we want to rename this ALBM folder to DCOLYMP. Okay, DCOLYMP and then just hit enter. And then once you've done that, just exit out of that, eject your SD card, take it out and put it inside your camera. So with your camera turned off, I then want you to press and hold the OK button and then turn the camera on. Then release the OK button straight away as soon as you flicked it on. Your screen will stay black, okay? So let's just do that again. Put the SD card in, hold down the OK button and switch the camera on. Okay, then release the OK button. Once it does that, you're gonna see this orange light at the front just on, and then when it starts blinking, that means the update is finished. You can now shut down your camera, take out the SD card, and then format it in your computer, and then put it back in the camera. You can go into the menu and check to see if your camera's been downgraded to version 3.4. And then from there, you can record unlimited. So on C4K, you will still get the limit. So you won't be able to record unlimited in C4K, Cinema 4K. But in all modes of 4K, you can do unlimited and it will work in all modes of 1080p as well, unlimited. So there you go, guys. That's it. So easy to do. And you can go out and record as much as you want. If you want to upgrade back to the version 3.5, the latest firmware, just use the normal Olympus software. But there's not much has changed. The only difference between 3.4 on this modified version and 3.5 of the Olympus version is that there's a lens that has been added for focus stacking. It won't mess with your autofocus or IBIS or anything like that. So go ahead and feel free to downgrade to this version. Unfortunately, this won't fix the file splitting. So a one hour recording in 4K will give you 12 different files. And a big shout out to Alpaco Films. He's an Olympus user. He's been using them for years. He's got a lot of videos about the Olympus cameras, specifically the EM1 Mark II, and he's dabbled in others as well. It was his process that actually helped me downgrade the firmware because what I was finding online wasn't working for me. His way is slightly different to mine when you press and hold the button and then turn on the camera. So if mine doesn't work, you can always check out his video, which I'll link down below and see if his method works better for you. Thanks Alpaco, you've been a great help mate. So now you're free to do your long form client talking interviews or your long form videos, weddings, whatever you want, or just go out and make some films like I did using multiple angles. Take care guys, I'll see you on the next one, later. I imagine that right now you're feeling a bit like Alice, tumbling down the rabbit hole. Hmm. You could say that. I can see it in your eyes.